Hello investors, welcome to Crypto Hulk's channel. Uh, it's a nice spring day here in Northern California. <laughs> you know, it's almost the middle of March and yeah, like on all the lounge chairs out here, there's snow. Yikes. Um, so let's get to the point. Um, I'm gonna tell you what's fake. Everybody knows, <clears throat> but nobody wants to say nothing about it. It's like this big, fucking elephant in the room and people are kind of looking at it a little bit the corner of their eye but this eight ton elephant is just sitting there and everyone knows it but nobody knows what to do <laughs> that's your stock market folks <clears throat> today it hit another high should be excited right should be totally excited about stock market hitting a record high knowing that we've been in a pandemic for over a year People haven't worked. Millions of people haven't even worked. Government's paying people's rent and everything like that. But yet, the stock market just keeps going up. Oh, must be a good economy. <laughs> well, of course, our news reporters are going to post all this, right? And they're going to report on exactly the state of the economy and what's going on. And no, they're just going to talk about dumb stuff all the time. Not let you know that all this money printing is gonna like totally destroy the American dollar. Oh, we don't wanna talk about that. That's the elephant in the room. The stock market's going up. Um, we don't wanna talk about why, how fake it is. We don't wanna talk about that shit, right? No, let's just ignore all that because that's gonna make whatever president at the time is look bad. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you like what's up. The reason now, this is just my opinion. I am not a financial advisor and don't do anything that I say and always follow the law. Um, stock market. It's at record highs, right? I mean, it went down a little bit and Biden said that uh, he's going to introduce a stimulus bill and whoop, right back up again or whatever. But it's sitting at record highs when uh, most Americans are either unemployed or, well, not want to say most. A lot of them, millions and millions and millions. People all around the world. The, econ the world economy shut down, in case you haven't noticed. Airline industry, almost every industry has just gotten hammered. Yet, stock market is at all-time high. What do you think about that? It's totally fake, if you understand. A lot of what, what I see, see, it's utility. Utility is what needs to drive a stock market. Has there been any <clears throat> like big, this lady's out in the snow. That's weird. <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry. Um, what's going on is you got people that aren't working. Stock market's going up. Here's what's up. The dollar's crashing and you still don't know it yet. I think it's, oh, I'm sorry, it's already crashed. And what's going on is that people are putting their money that they have out of the dollar. It's a bad thing. Out of the dollar and into the stock market because they're desperate. Normally, they'd have like a bank account or something like that. And um, they're taking all their money out of savings, the little that they have. And um, especially big, big corporations. That's what's really, really driving the stock market thing is <clears throat> the corporations don't necessarily know where to put money. They know they don't want to just hold cash reserves. So some of them are buying like the Bitcoin or whatever it might be. And um, they're investing their money into stocks, bonds, different kinds of things. Because like the money, the American dollar is just crashing like crazy, especially this next stimulus bill of $1.9 trillion. So that's what's going on. As our stock market right now goes up to record highs, the money starts going down to record lows, okay? So that's kind of what's up. What's going to happen is gold is gonna skyrocket along with silver and precious metals. And uh, the crypto, that's where this is leading to. Here we are about over halfway done with this video. So this is where I'm telling you, get the cryptos of your choice, the ones that have good utility, like I mentioned earlier, th cryptos that do things, okay? The stock market isn't really doing anything useful utility-wise. Like, okay, okay, what businesses across the whole stock market are doing well? Nothing, they're all getting hammered because nobody's working, or not that many people are working, so there's no money to spend at these businesses. 
airlines, I mean, I mean everything, travel industry, hotel, the, everything is just getting hammered. Restaurant, like, uh, people are out of work, so they can't buy stuff, but yet stock market's soaring. That's not utility, that's artificial, that's fake, and the stock market's gonna crash. Okay, hard, it's gonna crash. People are desperate and they know, businesses know, the dollar's gonna crash. So they're trying to pump money into something else other than holding cash reserves. You got it? That's where all this is coming from. <clears throat> Nobody's talking about the elephant and how it's screwing up the whole entire economy. <clears throat> but I'll talk about it. So what's going to save you is getting into this crypto, okay? The crypto is going to save your asses. Because these dummies out there now are buying this Bitcoin and dumping billions in it, whatever. When the XRP gets going... The smart people know, I'm just telling you about what's really going to win, and that's XRP and XLM. The smart people know this, but they're tricking you to make you think that Bitcoin's the one and it's not. When XRP gets released into the public and in the world to use, Bitcoin's history. It's like, who's going to want to buy a record when you can get like streaming music? You know what I mean? It's just like, some people will. They'll want the old tape, cassette tapes. Eight tracks, 45, 33 records and stuff, 78s. Um, but it's like the crypto is where, okay, for instance, with me, I pulled all my money like out of savings because I already know the dollar's not going to be worth nothing. And I put it all into crypto, like everything. Okay, not into just one, but, you know, um, that's what's going to happen. That's what these businesses are doing now, like MicroStrategies dumping like billions into Bitcoin and these other companies and then uh, other companies taking cash, like I said, out of their reserves and putting it into stocks, different kinds of stocks and bonds because they're desperate because they don't know about crypto. A lot of them don't. The ones that do play it off like, oh, it's all Bitcoin because they bought in and they want it to pump really high and then they're going to sell it and dump it when XRP takes over. See, you're already late to the party. So get with the right cryptos, XRP, XLM, VeChain, Algorand, Dara Hashcraft, and so forth, Algo or whatever, and, um, and and there's some other ones that have good, solid use cases. Don't be chasing pumps. That's retarded, okay? Because you're already late. If you're chasing the pump, check it out. You're chasing it. You're not riding the wave. You're already lost, okay? So get into something that's at a very low price right now that has great utility and beat the crowd. Get it while it's five cents and not while it's $500, got it? That's what you do. Don't be stupid and start trying to buy into some Bitcoin at $50,000. I don't care if it goes to a million later. I strongly doubt it will because it's just a useless coin. Go into something where it only is five cents and has the potential to go to maybe $1,000. That's where you make money, okay? So I'm going to close it off here. I was just watching the news and it just makes me sick how the stock market thing is, it's going to bust. It's called a retracement. Hello? It's a basic concept. Like it's a kindergarten kind of level of difficulty to understand. Stocks go up and if they keep going up, 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 up for a long, long, long time, they're going to crash. And that's what the stock market's going to do. <laughs> People are just dumping, people are desperate. That's why they're dumping money in the stock market. Not that it's useful. Stock market's not useful. People are out of work. There's no way in hell all these stocks are cost that much, right? It doesn't make sense, right? When things don't make sense in the stock market, they crash. That's what happened in the last stock market. It got really, really high in the 1920s and then boom. I think 1929 just boom, got decimated because it just kept going up for no reason. <laughs> Okay, so that's your little uh, pep talk for today. It's nice and warm out here, and uh, I think I'm going to have to get back to working out.